Hello Doom Channel and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, but my name is Mags Reloaded. We will get into introductions in just a moment, but first I want to go ahead and introduce this boss ass gameplay from Doom Crackers. His links will be in the description below. Um, coming out with an M27 IAR double chem strike on Octane playing hardcore domination. I don't know how this kid does it. Honestly, I don't know how anybody plays domination because Ghost is one of those Call of Duties that you just die so fast. It does not matter if you're around a corner or you're jumping up and down or you're in space. For some reason, you just die so fast. Three bullets and you're done no matter where you get hit from, um, which is ridiculous. But this guy manages to pull it out and he manages to lock down what is good spawn knowledge and also, he's able to use his ears. I, I watched this gameplay a couple times and I turned my, my own like really crappy headphones up um, and I was able to hear the fact that he was um, very capable of making sure he checks his corners and stuff, which is awesome. It's amazing. So you guys go ahead and check that out. Soak in the awesomeness that is this gameplay while I go on in this magical rant and tell you guys a little bit about who I am. As you can tell, I'm a new voice here on the Doom channel. Um, I was approached a little bit ago by the, the head the head honchos of the Doom Clan channel, and they pretty much asked me if I wanted to commentate some videos. So, as I said in the beginning of the video, my name is Mags Reloaded, or you guys can call me Mags. Um, and what I do on YouTube is I'm just a Call of Duty commentator. Pretty much whatever comes to my mind, I talk about it. And I play over games that I think are fun, which range anywhere between Call of Duty to Minecraft to Battlefield 4. Um, but uh, at the front of this entire game, whatever shenanigans. Uh, Call of Duty is very near and dear to my heart, so that's kind of what I stick to. Um, and it's one of the reasons why I actually said yes to jump on board with the Doom Clan um, to be able to commentate over some of their videos because I believe that some of the stuff that they do is just completely out of this world. I mean, superhuman cyborg stuff that they just sit down, these people turn on their Xboxes and they play and they play and they play and they play um, and they're able to pull out I mean, amazing gameplays one right after another. It's ridiculous how many gameplays these guys have stacked up because, I mean, I just, I've never seen anybody with that superhuman capability to just sit down on a game and just understand what's going on. Um, so pretty much that's it. A couple of things you guys probably want me to mention now. Um, yes, I am a female. Do I say that because I want people to hang on to the fact? No, it's just in the comment section, a lot of people are gonna be like, who's that really annoying 13 year old boy? I don't want him to commentate anymore. Um, yeah, so I'm just trying to dispel all of those rumors. So you guys can go ahead and check out my channel and see if that's something you like. But I strictly stick to the commentary stuff because, well, it's it's just what I seem to be good at. Um, now that we've got all that out of the way, Stranger Danger completely, we'll go ahead and jump into um, kind of a little bit of Call of Duty gameplay. And then we'll go ahead and talk about a little bit of different stuff at the end of the video. But... So, Call of Duty Ghosts, definitely been out. There's been a lot of ups and downs talking about this game. Like, is it something that people want to pursue? A lot of bigger commentators are saying they're getting really bored with it. And I've noticed a lot of people just saying that it's just not as fun as it, as it was, as it... I want to say compares to other Call of Duties. And I want to jump on that train so much, but I think it's just the COD-itis in me that is just completely dying out. I started playing Call of Duty at the tail end of World at War. I completely skipped over Modern Warfare 2. Um, and, and then I started playing Black Ops 1. I want to say Black Ops 1 is when I started hitting it heavy. Um, and I just started playing, got a couple hundred pluses on, on Black Ops 1, you know, ended up playing really good. Modern Warfare 3 came out, um, dropped Moabs, I mean, everywhere, all over the place. It, that one was a lot, a lot of fun. Um, Black Ops 2 kind of died off for a little, a little bit for me, getting all of the high kill streak swarms and stuff. I uh, nailed a couple hundred pluses on that one. And then we moved into Ghosts, and honestly, Ghosts is probably my least played Call of Duty. Um, and that's hard for me to say because I love Call of Duty. Actually, I love any video game that has a gun in it, but it seems to be very cut and dry. There's not much... I want to say pizzazz. There's not much pizzazz when it comes to Call of Duty. That's why I almost enjoy watching uh, more of the gameplay guys now because I want to know how they do it. How do they stay motivated? How do they get consistently get on a game that I think um, can be fun sometimes and then very lackluster in, at other times? And I have to sit down and watch. And this is one of the reasons that draws me towards the Doom channel. This is why I like watching gameplays like this because it's almost like every time I watch a video, I'm learning something a bit more constructive about the 
game. And I'm also learning about um, different kind of play styles. If you guys have watched any of the videos prior to this one, the different play styles are very evident. And I'm very good friends with um, most of the Doom players. Zoom, good friends with him. And, and I've watched, a like, I, I can't even tell you how many videos of his I've watched. And it just gives me a little bit more insight, a little bit more perspective. So to all of these Doom guys that come out here and who actually put in the work and actually bring up pretty good... I mean, pretty awesome gameplays. I commend them because there's no way that I could possibly sit here for more than two hours and play this game without getting A, frustrated, B, wanting to kill an entire village, or C, wanting to kick a puppy in the face. Um, that's just the way that it goes. And, and, and yeah, so... With that being said, um, I know that Ghost has call fallen a little bit off the train, and I know that Doom is really trying to kick it out, really trying to um, be on top of their game, trying to push the envelope, trying to push the bar. Um, and I want to know, what what's the next bar? Because, I mean, less than a week of the game being out, Zoom got a, a triple solo chem strike, you know? Or, uh, hold on, solo triple chem strike. That's the way you say it. A solo triple chem strike. And, um, and I'm kind of wondering what's the next step. We could always go for, you know, more kills and stuff or go for, like, bigger gameplays. Uh, but, but it kind of seems like the ceiling has already been made. So I, I'm waiting. I'm waiting to see what happens. Um, and other than that, other than Call of Duty noise and, and all of that junk that I've just talked to you about, um, there are other games on the rise, too. And I wonder if it's going to be one of those things that could be a potential Call of Duty killer. Doom Clan is a Call of Duty group. We all play Call of Duty. We love it. We love, and I don't want to say we love it as much as the game we love it. We love it as the competition, at least for me. And I might not be able to speak about everybody, but when I turn on Call of Duty, it's almost never about me, you know, really, really loving the game. It's almost always about me getting on and absolutely wanting to smear my enemies' faces in a big pile of dog crap. Like, that is exactly how I feel when I get on. I'm very super competitive, and that's just one of the things that I enjoy. Um, playing with Call of Duty and I'm pretty sure that all these Doom guys really really enjoy it too especially when some of them are playing solo some of them are just playing with friends and, and they manage to get such awesome gameplays um, but as always uh, you guys should go ahead and put it in the comment section below maybe what you guys think about motivation in Call of Duty what keeps these guys going maybe what you guys want to see as well as if you have any questions for me I'll be lurking this video anyways guys I'm gonna leave you out with these very dookie colored map and that's pretty much it but as always I'll do my sign off for my channel as always I hope you guys have a wonderful day I'm Mags peace